Well, hello, Coffee Time friends. How y'all doing? It's me, John, and Mama here at Coffee Time Tuesday evening. Mama's making supper tonight. We're having pea salad. Mama's pea salad, not just any old pea salad. Mama, tell us about it. All I'm going to do is use a can of peas and have eggs and stuff and... And she's instructed me to get these tomatoes cut, or this tomato. One tomato gonna do it? Yeah. Well, I can handle that job. And what with these eggs you just let out? A couple of them. Is that my corridor too? Yeah. Mm. Mm. Mama's giving out the directives. This is what we're having for supper tonight, folks. Don't, don't think, well, they're gonna have something in. Nope. Pea salad and crackers is what we're having. It's hot today. It's 80 something degrees. It's been hot. I got in the vehicle and it was hot. No, I'm ready for some salad time. Do y'all ever just eat one thing like that for a meal? Mama, I had them over there on you and you've left. Well, I went and it's not the way out. You want to cook over here? Yeah, I'll be right there. Get my stuff. I'm going to cook right here. You didn't open the peas? Uh, I think I was in the middle of it. Oh. What y'all doing today? Today's tax day. Do y'all know that? Oh, yeah. Vigo, I know that. <laughs> Vigo 18. This is, I don't know remembering it going that far before. And today is a sad day. Charles Stanley passed away. If you hadn't heard. Yeah, I've seen that. Um, I hated to hear that. I started opening these. Did I open them or not? That's a good question. I believe your can's a little dented. Well, that could happen. I'll strain them off to see how they are. It's me. Uh, well, come on. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to slice this tomato up while she's over there draining peas. Let's you know. Talk to me a while. What are y'all up to? What are you guys having for supper? Is it hot at your place? The trees have quadrupled in leaves this very week. I mean, I can tell. I've been on the road a lot this week. And we didn't have that many trees with leaves last week. And we sure do this week. And it's beautiful. The colors of spring are beautiful. If you enjoy the colors of spile, spile, Stop and enjoy the colors of spring. There's so many shades of green, so many colors out there. They're beautiful. Oh, wow, yeah. Somebody had on there file in six months or something like that. I think we ain't even got food. I can agree with the Mama. It's, I love file. But now I'm going to let you all have your spring and summer <laughs> and the hot weather. And hot weather, I'm going to get an onion. We don't always put tomatoes, but these romas are pretty good this time. Uh, I thought y'all was down here. This was over there. Went, Mama's come back though. I went and gathered a green onion, so I'm going to put a green onion in here instead of cutting the fat. So this okay. is my green onions I had in the garden. How many eggs you want in here? A couple, I think, should be enough. A cup. Just a couple eggs will do this every time. I'm gonna quarter these and then dice these. Like I said, family mama's like filming a housefly. She comes in the picture, I put you all on her, and then she goes out. Well, I have to. Oh, we know, mama. We know you got to roam. You don't want to eat dirty. I can't. I can't keep the cameras going. You give me chores, and you expect me to play cameraman. <laughs> I'm going to have to get one of those that follows you. Well. What are y'all eating tonight? We had <coughs> stew. Oh, yeah, that would be good. Oh, yeah. Mama, are you back? Now, uh, don't you move from that Velcro spot. <laughs> Velcro you in there. You're going to do like on TV, put an X on the floor and do No, it takes more than that for you, Mama. But I made to leave it. <laughs> I'm going to have to Velcro the floor and put it on the bottom of your shoes. <laughs> I'll slide out these shoes. Oh, I'm sure you would. <laughs> okay, Mama, get to cooking. Okay, all I'm going to do is take this uh, just sweet peas from Save a Lot, and I've drained them. And I'm not cooking them or nothing. And that is a, in case somebody asks, 
a 15 ounce can. I'm going to put a tablespoon of mayonnaise. Mm -hmm. And a dime size mustard, as you say. Dime size. And I'm chopping up fresh green onion out of Mama's garden. Yeah, I just got it while I go out of there. Onions are up pretty as they've ever been. I'll take you out back and show you Mama's Mother's Day present. I bought her some. <laughs> Mother's Day present. She's wanting, she's wanting to increase her raised beds. So I think I've got her fixed up. Yeah, I'm just get dirt for it. Get dirt. Get dirt. The right dirt. That's the problem. Yeah. That's about two teaspoons. Of two teaspoons of sweet pickle relish. Now you can use dill if you like. We always use sweet most of the time. Mama don't care for, she likes dill pickles on hamburgers, but she don't do a lot of dill relish. Just put it all in here and I play. I won't work my peas today. So here's all the two boiled eggs, one Roma tomato, and one green onion. Don't take a lot, folks. Into the pool. Mama, your pool's eat little today. Well, you know, I thought it would hold it, but that come up cutting quite a bit of stuff there. Yeah, I'm getting it in there. No. It'll hold it. Gently fold, as I say. You gonna put in salt and pepper in it? Uh, yeah. I'm gonna sprinkle a little because as I fold it now. Black pepper. Ooh. It's like the dusty kind. McCormick. What's that, Mama? And That's that green onion. And salt, how much? Just a sprinkle, cause those peas is probably... Shake, shake the salt. That's all it gets. Well, it's gonna be pretty. It is. It's beautiful. Can y'all see, Mama? Mama, you're in the other room. Oh. Surely I'm not. I'm right here. Mm, it's looking pretty already. Yeah. Mom and I, we didn't know how crazy weird we was on our eating until some of y'all brought it out. We thought everybody would fix a bowl of pea salad and eat with crackers and call it a meal. And we thought a lot of people would eat, you know, one or two things. So we do this often, don't we, Mama? Yeah, especially when it's hot or we're tired. Or... It's just food and it tastes good and it's what we like. Pea salad is often a whole meal here. Yeah. Now I'm going to get a little bit of cheddar cheese and sprinkle in it. Mm -hmm. And then we'll have the protein. And... Ain't that good? That's quick and simple. That's one of those, you know, sometime in the winter, you come home and you just eat your bowl of cereal. This is that equivalent. You just come home, open your can of peas, put your deviled egg or a boiled egg in it. If you have deviled eggs, you can use them uh, in pea salad. No problem at all. And um, it's good. That looks delicious. Uh, Katie, I hope it is. Me, they're frozen only peas, you mean? A lot of people don't like canned peas in their pea salad. This is where we've always fixed it. We use frozen peas, but there's a totally different taste to it. We use... Frozen peas, and then I'll chunk up some cheese, and we put um, mayonnaise in it. But the mayonnaise I put in it, usually I make into um, vinegar, sugar, mayonnaise, and make a dressing. Mom, that sure does look good. It is good. I love Mama's pea salad. And I'm not beating or stirring hard. I'm just trying to gently fold folding it in and stuff so that. The salad dressing, I mean the mayonnaise will coat and everything will be. I think it's ready. Yes, sir. Let's eat her up. And I'll get us some crackers. Get you us want the regular salt tunes or? Um, townhouse or whatever you got. Or those vegetable crackers or whatever you got. Surprise me on the crackers, Mama. Wow, and bring this? out the fine china, no dishes tonight. I'll let y'all sit close up. Now there it is. Let's tilt you down so you can get a good close up look. Now see, that's just plain old pea salad. And we eat it with crackers. 
Oh, what a delicious meal. Really, you got your protein with your eggs in there. You got your vegetables with your uh, pickle relish and your tomatoes and you got your peas. And then you got a little bit of mayonnaise and then you've got your, um, well, that's all you got, a little bit of salt and pepper. And here is some Townhouse Originals. Now this is the way we eat. What else are y'all having? Smells tell me something. I love pea salt. I've never had tomatoes in it. Well, we don't always put tomatoes, but these romas just happen to be extra good romas. So in the, the winter, we don't do a lot of tomatoes. Now in the summer, we will. Um, you lost what? I've run out of paper plates. Oh, run out of paper plates. Now, are you wanting tea? Um, unsweetened. Yeah, it's yeah. That's what I want. Unsweetened, no caffeine tonight. I know Mama will eat pizza, so I'm gonna give her some. Yeah, get her fixed up and ready to go. Now this will be enough for lunch tomorrow, and uh, Mama will eat that for lunch tomorrow. I was gonna tell y'all she ate two or three things this week or last week and this week, for lunch. And I was so pleased with her. She ate some leftovers, actually. Go figure. Go figure. Mama eating leftovers for lunch. I did today. Oh, what'd you have today? The, what you took? Potato salad. Yeah. Mama's been eating just regular food at lunch. I'm surprised at you, Mama. Yeah, I am too. <laughs> Surprise, surprise. It would be so good with saltines. It is good with saltines. It's good with townhouse too. I like it with saltines or townhouse. She just picked townhouse tonight and that's fine with me. I'll eat either way. Um, I like it both ways. Uh, fried catfish and coleslaw. Oh, wow. Oh, oh Thornton, right. Joe, where do you live? Could we get there before supper's over? <laughs> before the uh, fish gets gone. Before the fish is gone. <laughs> other night, I made tomato cracker salad. Love that. Oh, I've not had that this year. Um, Brenda, I've not had my tomato crackers this year. I've never I had pink salad. Brandy. Live a little. Live right out there on the edge, Brandy. Get you some can of peas or a, uh, some frozen peas, whatever you like, and uh, we'll uh, and have have you a good little treat. Let's bless it. Dearly Father, we thank you for this wonderful meal. We thank you for these precious hands that prepared it, dear Lord. And dear Lord, we just ask you to watch over us, lead, guide, and direct us. Be with our world. Be with all the nation around, dear Lord. And dear Lord, we just pray to be with each and every prayer request, so spoken and unspoken. In your precious name we pray. Amen. Mm -hmm. Let's do remember the Charles Stanley family. I know they're just heartbroken. Um, he had such a great ministry. If you've never watched his shows, I'm sure you can catch him on rewinds. And what a great inspiration he was. So um, just remember him. Remember his family. Yes. Mmm. It's absolutely delicious, Mama. <clears throat> that um, tomato and that little bit of green onion makes it taste like spring. Yeah, I love pig salad. Carmen, I do too. I'm 81 years young, and I love Mama's pea salad. I'm a country girl raised on a farm. <laughs> I love one thing meals. Oh, surely we do too. We love, like if we make macaroni salad, we'll sit and eat it with crackers, uh, won't we? Or I, I love to take macaroni salad and a slice of bologna and a slice of tomato and then some saltine crackers and just pile all that on there. <laughs> make a little uh, country hors d'oeuvres. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What else is one, one meals that we do, Mama? Well, potato soup's a wonderful. Oh, we'll do that. Nothing with it. Well, yeah. cornbread sometimes. Cornbread. We'll eat just cornbread sometimes. Uh, 
will eat just cornbread and butter and pile it a meal <laughs> and not eat nothing else with it. Um, there's a lot of things that we eat like that. And we're not depriving ourselves because this is absolutely filling. Oh, wow, yeah. It's got mm. everything in it. Absolutely filling. I don't know why it's freezing up tonight. It's no different than the same. Ham biscuit and green beans. Now that's something else, Betty. You know, a lot of people reserve their ham biscuits, their country ham biscuits, just for breakfast. You can have ham biscuits and mashed potatoes and green beans. What a wonderful supper. Been watching Dr. Stanley. What did I say? For 30 years. Yeah, uh, Tanya, it's sad. I've been watching that long, too. We had fried salt pork and pea salad tonight. Ah! Oh, Melissa, pea salad. There you go. It's just a pea salad kind of day. We had mini ground beef and cheese subs tonight. Oh, a sub. Never had had ground beef sub. <coughs> meatballs. They make meatballs. Cornbread is my favorite. Oh, Jolene, mine too. I love it. Tuna Mac salad. Mary, you just lost mama, but you got me. Hey, John and mama. Have a beautiful day. You too, Tracy. Hey, Carolyn. Never seen one item dinner. Carolyn. And you're a Davis. Mm. Carolyn, it's good. One item dinner? Mmm. Try it. You'll like it. Hello, John and Mama. Hey, guys. Hey, Diane. Sometimes you can break that old mold of meeting three or thinking you have to have a certain, certain, certain... You know, there ain't no rules. I used to do that all the time. Dr. Macaroni and cheese is another thing we'll fix and just eat macaroni and cheese. Yeah. Pasta salad is one thing meals also. Oh, oh I love yeah. that, Lisa. We'll be making some of that before too long. This is y'all's unsweetened sweet tea. It's good tonight. It's refreshing tasting. So y'all's name is y'all's sweet tea. But it's up to you what sugar you put in it. And this is just... This is just, no just, sugar. <laughs> no sugar. Just the tea boiled. Not even boiled. Just steeped and poured over the ice. I finished the last of the peach tea I had made this week. <laughs> it's got sugar in it. Yeah. But it's got caffeine too. So I didn't fix no more. It's so late. I figured I'd fix it tomorrow. Drank it earlier. But this unsweetened tea is so refreshing. I love it. Mm mm mm. Try some pea salad, folks. Put that little sprinkle of cheddar cheese in it. Just adds one more little element that we like. This is the kind of thing that can stand alone or it can stand with a whole crowd of food. Um, we have had this at Christmas or at Thanksgiving before on the table. Depending on who was here, pea salad is not is is not something you just have to have for a picnic or something you can have no. for a whole meal. It's got so much in it that you really don't need a lot of other stuff with it. Mm -mm. Mama, what have you been up to today? Nothing much. Checked on my beans this morning. Earlier. It looked like something had been done out on the front patio. Oh, I worked out there some slap clean. Move furniture. We're getting around to the truth now, folks. <laughs> I forgot about doing that. That was earlier. I've not even been to the backyard. How do you do nothing in the backyard? Okay, I'll go check. I walked down to the bed and I thought my little beans had... Uh, Got bit last night because mm -hmm. there's frost on the neighbor's house and our house this morning early. Mm -hmm. But they look good and the sun had done hit them. So usually if the sun hits them, they turn dark, you know. But, right. But they had looked good, so I hope they survive it. If they don't, we'll plant some more. You'll just have to put some more beans in the ground. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'll plant Mama was worried about last night. I said, Mama. 
You planted them early. I was going to go cover them up. <laughs> you know your chances. That's the truth. There ain't no sense of getting out here and covering everything up. If it, do, if it works, it works. If it don't, you'll just have to plant some more. I did used to do that. We would plant stuff early. We'd spend an hour or two at night covering everything up. And then the, out other than getting out and uncovering for the sun. Yeah. <laughs> and then in the fall, we'd cover up flowers and mums and let nature take its course. If it's time, it's time. The last year we did that was year four last, and we covered up everything, and it still got bit. Oh, Honestly, yeah. That's it. No more. That's ridiculous. We was out there with sheets and it was it looked like a, a ghost convention out in the yard. <laughs> and the way the bed, winds are blowing, I was going to put uh, boxes over my beans last night, but that wind was so powerful, I'd had to put cinder blocks on top of them to keep One thing you can do, I guess everybody knows this, is wedding. you can go out early in the morning before the sun comes up and just sprinkle them down with water. Wash the frost off from them, and when the sun comes up, it doesn't cook them a lot of times. But other than that, I ain't doing it. Well, Mama, you got anything else for tonight? No. Folks, that's all we got tonight. Peace salad. It was quick and easy. If you're looking for a quick and easy supper, can of peas. Can of peas. Uh, how much mayonnaise? A tablespoon. Tablespoon, tablespoon of mayonnaise, a dime-sized glob of French's yellow mustard, a, two teaspoons of sweet pickle relish, two boiled eggs chopped up, one Roma tomato chopped up, and one green onion. And a little bit of crackers. Salt things are delicious with this. It's so it's kind of uh, cheddar cheese. And a sprinkle of cheddar cheese, and you two can have supper that quick. We've had supper, we've eaten, and we have no dishes, because I'm taking this with me. And it's uh, it's good. It's it's as good as eating a salad, you know, if you're oh, eating yeah. a green salad. Crazy. And pink salad's delicious on a salad. Mm -hmm. I mean, you talk about a full-fledged salad. Put you some iceberg or, or some uh, spinach. Put you some pea salad on it. you got a salad, dressing included. Oh, that tea's so good. Y'all's sweet tea. Y'all's great. Mama, mm -hmm. we may have to make some peach tea tonight, so I'll have it for lunch tomorrow. Oh, um, I was going to say, sure that you won't drink it tonight with the caffeine in it. No, but I sure will tomorrow. <laughs> well, Mama, if you don't have nothing else, we won't hold these folks. We thank y'all for joining us. We really do. And when we hold you too long, we don't mean to. We've had a few people say, I like your videos, they're just too long. But it's because we do them live. We don't do any cuts or breaks or pauses. It's hard to cook anything and get it prepared, cooked, and tasted, which we try to put all those elements in there. So we're trying to do better. We just ask you to bear with us. And hopefully we'll get the knack of all that. Ain't that right, Mom? Cooking just takes time. Cooking takes a minute. It takes a minute. And uh, when you're... Salad, don't take long. <laughs> no, it don't. So we're trying to prep a little deeper, do a little better. But anyhow, we, we thank you all for being here. And we don't want to hold you too long. We don't. Huh? I said thank you so much for it. Yes. We don't want to hold you too long. We don't want to make it a misery on you. We really don't. We try to do... And we listen to y'all. When y'all call me... We try to listen, you know, and take, if it's good, if it's good advice. You know, when people are, are hateful or nasty about it, we just delete them. But when you're just saying, then we listen. We listen because we care about what y'all think and your family. And we love having you here. We really do. So uh, we're going to say, you know, have a blessed night. Mama, say good night to the fine folks. Good night, Mama, and God bless you all. Have a wonderful day tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye, bye. bye y'all.